So yeah, um, I am back. Okay, yeah, I am back with the continuation of my um, Mario Gear Solid Integral um, playthrough. Um, picking up where I left off, which is near the end. Honestly, which is which is near the end. We are like um, near the um, final leg of it. So when we left off, we had defeated the Hind D. We had defeated the um, we had defeated Sniper Wolf again, and we defeated um, Sniper, uh, Falcon Raven. So now we are so close. Now we are ever so close to Meridia West. But, but, um, something's not quite right. Um, turns out Naomi. Well, first off, turns out, um, Decoy Octopus was, the, 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 um, Dopper Chief that died in front of us was Decoy Octopus the whole time. <laughs> and it turns out that Naomi Hunter might not be who she says she was. So... This is, um, so this is where they say is where the plot thickens. But yeah, um, I'm gonna be, um, I'm gonna be picking up, um, where I left off. Um, considering where I am, considering where I am, um, I might be able to finish this up in this dream. I might be able to, I might be able to finish this up, um, in the stream, and then we can move on to, um, Mary Gets Solid 2, um, Sons of Liberty, um, afterwards. But yeah, um, yeah, um, I thank you all for, um, dropping in, dropping in, and, um, and hanging out, and everybody on YouTube, um, thank you all for watching my, um, Mary Gets videos, I hope you guys have been enjoying them. And, um... Let's go! Metal Gear, a race. Nope. <laughs> Alright. Let's pick up where we left off. Okay, so here we are. Um, back to the warehouse. I made sure my, um... Rations don't freeze. We don't, we don't want that. This, this is very cold in here. This warehouse is the um, coldest part of the base. Um, besides going outside into the um, Alaskan cold itself. So yeah, um, if you're not careful, if you're not careful, your rations will freeze. And um, as Master Miller said, as Master Miller said, one way to um, prevent your rations from freezing is by keeping them close by equipping them. So um, that's what I'm doing now. I'm gonna have a little chat with the Colonel, just real quick. Snake, if it's about Naomi, I'm looking into the matter right now. Give me a little more time. Where is she? She's still sleeping. I can't believe it. First, the DARPA chief turns out to be an imposter, and now Naomi. What the hell is going on here? I suppose you're going to tell me you don't know anything, right? I'm sorry, Snake. A uh, madman is threatening the world with a nuclear weapon. I guess that's what I should worry about now. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Um, uh, what does Master have to say? Snake. I'm sure that woman calling herself Naomi is some type of spy. And now I'm starting to think that Campbell might be hiding something too. Don't trust him. Oh, don't worry. If I was Nate, the level of people that I'd be trusting right now is significantly low. <coughs> okay, so... This is the hallway into Meridia's hangar. That's the door to the hangar up ahead. But A, but 
two things. A, we got gun tourists lined all throughout these walls. Um, too many to take out with a steamer. Unless you have the banana. Um, and B, there are floor traps. So, we're going to get as close as we can. And now you see all the gun cameras in place. Lots of them. Over there, over there, over here, and over this way behind these walls. So yeah, too many to take out with a steamer. With, um, too many to take out with steamers. And you all don't need those steamers, by the way. So make sure you, um, so make sure you start up. So, uh, yeah, throw a chap grenade. And while the turrets are jammed, move. So that was 15, um, Steiner's hits. That was 15 Steiner, um, missiles I just picked up. And, um, I just remembered. I just remembered. I was going to go outside. I, now that I got a level 7 card, which is the maximum level card that we can have, I was going to go outside to, um, where, um, we fought Sniper Wolf and check out that room. And check out that room, um, that we couldn't get to. Because we didn't get, because we didn't have a high enough, um, card. So, one last batch pack. One last batch track. And you, honestly, you're going to be doing a lot of bad track during these uh, final hours of the game. Honestly, you're, you're going to be doing a lot of bad tracking. And honestly, you might be okay. It might, it might be okay. Um, those rooms, that, that, all those rooms that were lined around, um, that snow field, um, had, um, lots of weapons and ammo, um, that we could pick up. So I think the detour is worth it. I think the detour is um, worth it. Definitely don't need more chap grenades. Definitely don't need more chap grenades. Do you have the upcoming boss battle? I'm not going to say, um, who you're going to be facing next, though you can probably guess, but you're all going to need primarily, you're only going to need chapter nades and stinner missiles for the next boss fight. And then, the final boss fight afterwards. Doesn't matter how many ammo or weapons you have. But yeah, I hope everyone's I hope everyone's doing okay. I hope everyone watching is um I hope you all are doing okay. It's been um 
It's been a hot minute since I last dreamed. Because I've been sick. I, um, yeah, I got cold, um, last Thursday. And, um... Yeah, I've been sick for the good part of the week. But I'm better now. I am better now. Okay. Yeah, this way. We are going to take this, um... We are going to take this elevator up here. This is how you don't. This is how you get to and from the um, upper um, upper level. I wonder what Colonel has to say. I wonder what they have to say about me being back up here instead of where I'm supposed to be. Snake, hurry up and get to Metal Gear's underground base. It's north of the warehouse where you fought Raven. Sound travels better in cold environments. If you're going to use a handgun, you should equip a suppressor. I'm way ahead of you, Master. But yeah, you probably notice I'm sounding a little um, nasally. Especially now that I'm doing all this talking. Okay, so... She's gone. Her body is gone. I want to take a I want to take a picture. Okay. Hi. I see I have met I um I see I have met the Council of Gunters. And I do not think that they um, unanimously agreed that I am a friend. These are better be dinner missiles I'm picking up. Oh yes, they are. Okay. Is the wolf following me? Plus ten grenades. You know, I know that's probably a. Uh, I know that's probably a wild wolf. But you know, maybe Otacon should adopt it. I know. Um. I know, um, Wolf would probably love it if, um, Otacon was taking care of one of her, uh, of one of her, um, dogs. Well, these had better be, um, chat grenades. Yep, they are. Well, one of them, two of them is. Now, should be some um, weapons on the far side here. I don't fancy another. I don't fancy a ride on a truck. Uh, this room so hard. This that room hardly seems worth it.
Those are probably Nikita missiles. Which I don't need. You take care of yourself, puppy. You take care of yourself. It'll be handy when I get to Mayor Gear Side 2 where I'll be able to um, shoot out those um, cam um, cameras and well, I'll be able to shoot out those cameras. And I played a bit more, um, and, um, I played a little bit more of, uh, VR missions. Um, the, uh, the, bon the um, special, di the special U.S. disc, um, uh, VR missions. Um, pretty close to 50%. Pretty close to 50%. So, I'm not sure if I have to, um... I'm not sure if I have to get um, first place in all of those um, time um, challenges in, or, um, in order to get to 100. Ow. That was worth it not to raise the chaff. Oh, oh no, no, this isn't this, this, this isn't turning out to be a lengthy um detour. But yeah, I did I, I did um progress enough to unlock the um photo sessions with Na with Naomi like um let's see how do i access my um go to media gallery real quick <laughs> here we go um just a few of the photos I took of Naomi. <gasps> Don't judge me. Oh yeah, and I did um and I um I did take um a few um um ghost pictures. I did take a few ghost pictures of, um, <laughs> in the, um, base Metal Gear Solid game from this collection. And got a troll, and got a before that. Now, that being said... That being said, um, is there a trophy for, is there a trophy for collecting all of the, uh, for finding all of the ghost photos? No. There, there should have been a trophy. For finding um, all of, all of the ghost photos. A trophy for collecting one? That's fine. But there should have been a trophy.
for finding all of the ghost photos. Nice of them to um, dump some more chapter names for me. And it looks like um, the steel missile is also replenished. So honestly, I don't need any more. I've grabbed enough. So yeah, you know you probably know I'm sounding a little nasally. I'm I'm better now. But. Not hundred percent. Okay. We're here at last. We are here at last. Hey Owan, how's it going? What can I do for you, Snake? How's it going, buddy? Bestie? In China, they say, the Alarcon to my solid snake strikes swiftly. It means that if you have confidence that what you are doing is part of your true nature, there should be no hesitation. I don't know whether your orders are in your true nature or not, but Snake, believe in yourself. It's going okay. How are you? How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. A little um nasally, but. Sounding a little nasally, but I'm 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 good. Snake, stop that launch. Head for the control room in the underground base. The control room is on the third floor of the underground base, isn't it? There's no time. I wonder if I control Otacon about that thing right now, or if I have to wait. I don't know anything about Doctor Naomi, so there's not much I can okay. say. Okay. Uh, right. Are we ready, guys? Are we ready to meet the big guy? I present to you Metal Gear Wes. Oh, Wessy himself. Vulcan cannons inside his head, a laser cutter on his belly, anti-personnel uh, missiles, and I believe um, anti-tank missiles on the on his legs and back, and of course that whale gun. Met the big Mecca himself. I should take a photo. Commemorate this moment. So, the control room is on the third floor. That's where we have to go. Snake, it's me. What's wrong? Did you find a good place to hide? Yeah, thanks to the stealth gear. It looks like they've finished getting Metal Gear ready. How do you know that? I overheard them talking. Where are you now? Right in front of Metal Gear, but it's strange. What is? There's nobody here. No guards. Nobody patrolling. 
it's too quiet. Maybe because they're all ready. They said they even input the PAL codes. What should I do? All we can do is use the override system that President Baker told you about. But I've only got one of the three keys. And besides that, like Ocelot said, there's some trick to using the keys. Leave it to me. You got some kind of plan? Well, I'm in the computer room right now. I'm trying to access Baker's private files. Baker's files? Don't you need a password? Of course, but there are ways. Are you a hacker? Yep, that describes me pretty well. Does it look like you can get in? I don't know yet. I'll give it a try. I'm counting on you. A hacker is about to save the world. But yeah, it's a little bit fishy. Isn't it a little bit fishy that um, there are no guards patrolling? Not one. About the only guard patrolling, about the only guard patrolling is on the third floor there. That's about it. That's about all the guards that we have patrolling here. So, we're gonna go over here. See what items we can pick up. I should be good on, I, I should be good on tap. And I'm good on Xeno Missiles too. I, I honestly should be good for the um, Nest boss fight. Okay, so just brace yourself, guys. Um, ooh. This is a scary concept you guys are about Great. to hear. So what do you got? I accessed the confidential Metal Gear file. So what about the PAL override system that Baker talked about? I haven't found it yet. That's what I need to know. But Snake, I found something else. What? The secret behind the new nuclear weapon. Just as I thought, the nuclear warhead is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. It doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Yes, but effective. And that's not even the scariest thing about this weapon. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. You mean it won't show up on radar? Yeah. The truth is, they've been working on a stealth missile since the late 70s. Why weren't they able to develop one until now? Because of the missile rocket propulsion system, it would be picked up by enemy satellites. Oh yeah, that makes sense. But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant, so it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. An invisible nuclear warhead. Totally impossible to intercept. And on top of that, Damn. it's got a surface-piercing warhead designed to penetrate hardened underground bases. Yeah, we learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world. It's the ultimate weapon. And from a political point of view, it avoids the problem of nuclear reduction and nuclear inspections. Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? I'm listening. If word of this got out, it could delay the signing of the START III treaty and cause a huge international incident. Yeah, it would be nasty. It is. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. 
Did you know this, Colonel? <coughs> I'm sorry. You changed, Colonel. I won't make any excuses. Snake, listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested, only simulated. You mean they ran a computer model? Yeah, that's why they were conducting this exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? It looks like it went better than they hoped for, but I can't find the data anywhere on this network. You'd think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. What? Do you still have it? No. Ocelot took it from me. Damn. The terrorists have replaced yeah. the dummy We're going to suffer for that. Warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So you think they can do it? Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now, I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're counting on you. Yeah, it makes you wonder what were they thinking, um, making a weapon like that. I mean, they had to know. They had to know the hell from the hell that were, um, everybody. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to wait for him to come back and then get him with the PSG one. You notice that the radar is offline. So I... So it's, um, outside of using first person view, it's going to be hard to see where he's at. Armstead or Baker um, the excuse to create a weapon so um, dangerous and potentially um, and potentially world, end world ending movie time Entered the PAL codes and disengaged the safety device. We can launch any time. There's still no response from Washington. It looks like we'll have to show them that we mean business. Should I set it for Chernobyl <coughs> in Russia? <coughs> no. There's been a change. The new target is Lochnor, China. Why, boss? I'm sure neither you nor Mr. Golukovich would really like to see a nuclear bomb dropped on your motherland, right? Liquid. Of but course why? he's surprised. There's nothing there. Wrong. It's a nuclear test site. A nuclear test site? If we nuke a major population center, the game's over. But a nuclear explosion at a test site can still be concealed from the public. Meanwhile, Washington will be worried about the retaliatory strike from China. That'll probably mean top secret talks between both countries' leaders. Of course. And in the process, the President will be forced to divulge the existence of a new and highly destabilizing nuclear weapon to the Chinese. What do you think that will do to the U.S.'s reputation? Or the President's? A 
And with the CTBT, that means that China and India, I see. Yes. When the other countries hear about this new weapon, they'll all want to contact us. Washington won't be very happy when we start selling their own system to the highest bidders. Yes, the president will break. He will give in to our demands. Big Boss's DNA and one billion dollars. Billion dollars? That money will be used to cure our genome soldiers as well. I'm also including the Fox Dye vaccine in our demands. Fox Dye. It killed Octopus and the arms tech president. So it's true that it affects older people first. Mantis might not have been affected because he wore a mask. Wolf wasn't infected either. Perhaps due to those tranquilizers she always took. Something to do with the adrenaline level in the blood. Or maybe it's just because this fox dye was still experimental and they haven't worked out all the bugs yet. In any case, have you heard from your friend, Colonel Sergei Golukovich, at the Spetsnaz? He still has doubts about the ability of Metal Gear. He said we can talk after Metal Gear's test launch is successful. Hmm, he's a very prudent man. There's nothing to worry about. The Colonel wants Metal Gear and a new nuclear weapon so bad he can taste it. If Russia wants to regain its position as a military superpower, they need to reinforce their nuclear arsenal. They need a nuclear weapon that can't be intercepted. Metal Gear will allow them to gain first strike capability over the rest of the world. Their regular army is in shambles, and they think they can restore their country's military power with nuclear weapons? Golukovich, he's no warrior. He's a politician. But he's the one who gave us the hind and most of our other heavy firepower. He's got over a thousand soldiers under his command. If we join forces, we could put up quite a resistance here. Since Mantis died, the genome soldier's brainwashing has started to wear off. I'm worried about the men's morale. An alliance with the Russians would boost that as well. What are you saying? We're not going anywhere. We're going to dig in here. We could still escape. We've got the most powerful weapon ever made, and we're about to ally with Golukovich's forces. Are you going to fight the whole world? <laughs> What's wrong with that? We can launch a nuclear warhead at any target on this planet. A nuclear warhead invisible to radar. And on top of that, this base is full of spare nuclear warheads. Once we get the DNA and the money, the world will be ours. What about your promise to Colonel Golukovich? I have no interest in the revival of Mother Russia. You're not thinking of reviving Big Boss's dream. From today, call this place Outer Heaven. Big boss's dream. Where soldiers will Big always boss. have a place. You're not worried about the PAL being overridden. If the code is in it again, it'll be deactivated. No need to worry. The DARPA chief they of the see us. Are both dead. Does Snake know how the override system works? You interrogated him, don't you know? He didn't have any keys on him. Good. Then no one can stop Metal Gear now. By the way, what should we do with that woman? Want me to kill her? Let her live. She's Campbell's niece, and Snake cares for her. We'll keep her as our ace in the hole. Meryl, she's alive. For now. Snake, I found Baker's top secret files. Great job. How's it going there? They've finished inputting the PAL codes. So how do we deactivate them? Okay. You see, the override system that the president was talking about, it can also be used to input the detonation codes. You see, if you insert the keys when the warhead is active, you deactivate it. And if you insert them when it's inactive, it becomes activated. And you can only use the keys once. Only once, huh? Yeah. You better get started. We don't have much time. But it takes three keys, right? I've only got one of them. Hold on a minute. You see, that's the trick. You already have all three keys. What are you talking about? The card key is made of a shape memory alloy. Shape memory alloy? Yes. It's a material that changes shape at different temperatures. The key is Like the stuff was brought from the previous game. Key. Yeah. The card key changes shape at different temperatures. So this key is actually three keys.
keys in one. Clever. Can you see the input terminals in the center of the control room? I see them. Those three laptop terminals are for the emergency input. There should be a symbol on each screen. Each symbol corresponds to a different key. Input the keys in order from left to right. The left one's for the room temperature key. See the symbol? Next to that goes the low temperature key. The one on the right is the high temperature key. Okay, I got it. First, I change the shape of the card, and then I input them in order, right? That's right. All you do is insert the card keys. After you insert the key into the module, a hard disk reads the information contained on it. Once you've finished with all three terminals, the code input process is complete. But here's the thing. You can only use the key three times. It's an emergency system. It's only meant to be used once. The world is riding on that key, Snake. Yeah. Watch out! Damn! Snake, he had one job. Snake, this is bulletproof glass. There's no way in. No I'm problem, Chef. I appreciate the support. Die. Good, um, <laughs> good, good luck on your stream. Snake, you've got to get that key. Okay. Now we got one. Right, time to one. Oh. So you just have to. So you just have to one to the top of Metal Gear. They actually won't. Um. Hang on. They actually won't follow you up this ladder for some odd reason. Don't ask me, don't ask me why they won't. Pretty odd that they won't follow me up the ladder. Okay, so we got you had we have to head down all the way to the first floor and I'm um, trying to find the key in the drainage ditch Now you can actually find the key. Oh hi rat. Oh No ladders your only weakness well, apparently it was, um, the guard's only weakness, too. Then only being able to see, um, diagonally. Oh, I got bomb. Get rid of it. Snake, did you find the key? No, it's not here. Don't be ridiculous. You saw it fall into the drainage ditch, didn't you? The drainage ditch. Isn't there something odd about it? No. There are a lot of big rats, though. That's it, Snake. A rat must have eaten it. Now who's being ridiculous? No, I'm right. There's no other possibility. Rats eat all sorts of things. There's nothing unusual about that. Okay. So yeah, let's get out of the drainage ditch. Which, by the way, the drainage ditch water does damage us so we we so we can pick up the key we can pick up the key with um the mind detector you can we can see the key car moving with the mind detector so yeah like master said um the rat, um, like Master said, um, the rat, one of the rats ate the car key. That's why, that's why we see it moving. So, this dut here, this little dut, is one of the dust that the rats will come out, will come out of. Now, the only thing, about the only way I can catch it, 
is by laying a trap for it. So press, some, so lay some C4 at the entrance of the duct. Wait for the rat with the key to come out, and then boom. And do you remember? Do you, do you remember? Um, back when we um, blew up those rats. Um, near, near where we fought, near where we first fought, um, Sniper Wolf, and Colonel called us and was like, Snake, we don't need that rat trap. We need someone to stop that newt. Guess what they needed? A rat trap. Turns out Campbell needed a rat trap, after all. That rat, is sure, that rat sure is taking a sweet time. Right, here it comes. Bye bye, rat. And hello, car key. Okay, so now. We have to head all the way back to the um, control room and insert the first key. Now we gotta be careful heading into the control room because the control room, um, because there are security cameras um, outside and inside um, the control room and we get spotted by them if we get spotted then the control room will close up trap is inside and the um, whole room will be flooded with gas so um, I either throw some Either throw some chaff or find a way to um, avoid find, find a way to avoid the um find a way to avoid the um security cameras like that. Freeze the key. So now we gotta get into a code environment to um freeze the key. Next you've got to cool the card key. Where should I do that? This is Alaska. Go outside. It's cold everywhere. Smart ass. You're close to the warehouse where you fought Raven, right? That place is right in the middle of the permafrost layer, and there's no heater either. That key is actually an IC card. Its connector pins and main body are made of a shape memory alloy. It's designed so that unless it's been changed to the correct shape, it won't be recognized by the PAL code input terminal in the control room, and the detonation code won't be entered. Okay, so... One, all the way back to where you fought on um, Fulton Raven. We have to head all the way back. And this is what I meant when I said that you have to do a lot of backtracking. So you have to backtrack and you have to you have to do an even longer backtrack in order to warm the key. But uh, we'll get to that when we get to it. Oh, 
Fortunately, it's a quick. Fortunately, it's a quick hop. Fortunately, it's a quick hop. Um, over to that um, warehouse. This would, this would have been a good time to add a SpongeBob narration a few minutes later. Okay, so, um, same deal as before. Chaff those turrets. Okay, now we wait. Now we play the waiting game. Wait for the car key to change color. The um, item window will show what color the um, key card is at. Right now it's yellow, which is normal. We gotta get it to blue. So, um, just give it time, give it time, um, check regularly. And also, um, make sure that your rations don't freeze. Speaking wish. I don't really care what rank I get at the end of this. I am pretty far from being able to... Uh, at this point, I am pretty far from being able to get um, the best rank. Okay. Blue alert. Blue alert. Party is now blue. Nah, I'm not gonna say that. Okay, so just um one back over to the control room and then insert that car key. Also this goes without saying, but the longer you take gain there, um the longer you take gain there, um, the more chance, it, the more chance you'll be of the um, car key going back to yellow. So um, best not to dilly dally. Do do do. Do, do, do. Hey, Owan, are you still here? Are you still here? I'm curious about something. No, okay, I, I can't really say no scope, because I was using scope. I'm pretty sure Snake, sh I I'm pretty sure, um, Snake could have no scoped it. Okay, there goes pal code number two. 
Next comes pal number three. Warm the key. And where do we warm it? Let's ask Otacon to find out. Somewhere warm? What about the blast furnace? But the problem is, if you go through a cold place on the way back, the card key might change shape. You need to hurry on the way back. Right. So, go, go all the way back to the blast furnace. Back up two sets of back through the warehouse, two sets of cargo elevators, and then do the same on the way back. This is what I meant, this is what I meant when I said an even longer backtrack. Curious to call Cambo, see what he has to see if has, see if he's had anything to say. Now you've got to warm the key up. Find some place hot. Uh what about Master? Now you've got to warm it. You need to find some place hot. That's it? Now you've got to Yeah, that's it. weapons and weapons of mass destruction. Conventional weapons are intended for use against military targets, but nuclear weapons are used against non-combatants. Nukes are designed to kill tens of thousands of innocent civilians in a flash. That is why nuclear weapons are so evil. No arguments here. Yeah. Yeah, blow my nose here. Got some congestion. More brain cells being lost, guys. Sometime if all that clears up. <laughs> yeah, don't me some time before that before that clears up. Getting a code. Ain't it a bitch? Save. I'm gonna save before I make the trek. You call Snake? Snake, Leo DeRocher said, win any way you can. Nice guys finish last. What about you, Snake? Is that what you think? Is there anything that you wouldn't do to stay alive? You should think about that, Snake. Of course, we won't be bored going up and down the cargo elevators. We'll have some refilling, um, codec conversations to keep us occupied. Now, this warehouse is going to have soldiers now. Warehouse, warehouse is going to have, warehouse now has armed soldiers patrolling so um keep them um keep them um in mind as you go through there
Yeah, how's um how's every, how's everybody's evening going? Everybody having a nice evening so far? How are you how are those clothes going to get out of the base? It's about Naomi Hunter. Then you should talk to the Colonel. He's looking into it. Turn your monitor off. Okay, it's off. No one else can hear us. Go ahead. Sorry, but I didn't want the Colonel to hear. Okay, so what's up? I've got a good friend in the Pentagon. Yeah? He's the one who told me about it. It looks like the DIA recently developed a new type of assassination weapon. An assassination weapon? Snake. Have you ever heard of something called Fox Dye? No. Fox Dye. Liquid and the others were talking about it. Yeah. It's some kind of virus that, that targets specific people. I don't know all the details, but... What are you trying to say? It's too similar. What is? The cause of death. Didn't the arms tech president and the DARPA chief, I mean, decoy octopus, die of something that looked like a heart attack? Yep. Yeah. Well, apparently, Fox Die kills its victims by simulating a heart attack. No. You're telling me that Naomi was behind it? Snake, try to remember. Did Naomi give you some kind of injection? The nanomachines. She was in the best position to have done it, but I don't know what her motive was. Does the Colonel know? I'm not sure. But he still hasn't questioned her. Okay, I'll ask him myself. Colonel, what's new with the Naomi situation? I just placed Naomi under arrest. Arrest? She was sending coded messages towards the Alaskan base. I didn't want to believe it, but she must be working with the terrorists. Are you sure? I'm afraid so. She's being interrogated now. What kind of interrogation? Well, I'd like to avoid the rough stuff, but we don't even have any sodium pentothal here. Call me if you find out anything. So it's true, isn't it? Naomi, I can't believe it. That means the Fox Dye vaccine must be around somewhere. Listen, I've got bigger things to worry about. But Snake, you might be infected too, you know. All I can do is leave it up to the Colonel. If you can still trust him. If you can still trust him after he lied to you. One set of ow. Got one set of got one. Of, I thought it was that thing. I thought I had already arrived um, at the blast furnace, but no. I I, I got one more. Um, I got one more set of. Part of elevators to go to go through. All right, we're here now. This time, I'm sure um, I'm on the right floor. Okay, so it. Okay, so this is a steam room. 
this is um this steam room is where we is where we can safely um wait for the um key to change without worse without risk of being spotted. So um so yeah um just wait just wait until the key just wait until the key um changes color. Problem is this camera. Problem is, um, we won't. We we don't know what's outside. What, what's outside? Okay, red alert. Red alert. The car key has changed color. Now we hoof it. We hoof it over. We hoof it over. Hoof it, hoof it all, all the way back. Um. All the way back to the control room. See if I can avoid. Never mind. So much for avoiding getting my ball shot off by the gun turrets. Okay, so we're gonna have a coded conversation here. I need to blow my nose again. Is true. Yes, but not everything I said was a lie. Who are you? I don't know myself. I don't know my real name or even what my parents looked like. I bought all my identification, but my reason for getting into genetics was true. Because you want to know yourself, right? That's right. I want to know where I came from, my, my age, my race, anything. Naomi. I was found in Rhodesia sometime in the 80s, a dirty little orphan. Rhodesia? What's now known as Zimbabwe? Yes. Rhodesia was owned by England until 1965, and there were lots of Indian laborers around. That's probably where I got my skin color from, but I'm not even sure about that. Naomi, you're too worried about the past. Isn't it enough to understand who you are now? Understand who I am now? Why should I? No one else tries to understand me. I was alone for so long, until I met my big brother, and him. Your big brother? Yes. Frank Yeager. What? He was Very a young same. soldier, when he picked me up near the Zambezi River. I was half dead from starvation, and he shared his rations with me. Yes, Frank Yeager. The man who you destroyed was my brother and my only family. No. Great father. We survived that hell together, Frank and I. He protected me. 
It's my one connection. The sorry about this. Connection um, I have to my sorry past. about blowing my nose dry. And he brought you back to America. No. I was in Mozambique when he came. Who is he? You mean Big Boss? Mm hmm. Yes. He brought us to this land of freedom, this America. And then he and my brother went back to Africa to continue the war. And that's when it happened. Zanzibar. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge and joined Foxhound. I knew it was my best chance to meet you and I prayed for the day that I would. So, were your prayers answered? Yes. I waited two long years. To kill me? Is that all you cared about? Yes. That's right. Two years. You were all I thought about for two long years. Like some kind of twisted obsession. You still hate me? Not exactly. I was partly wrong about you. What about Liquid and the others? <laughs> I'll have my revenge on them too. Naomi. She can be predictive. You didn't kill that doctor too, did you? The one that used Gray Fox for his genome experiments? Dr. Clark? No. That was my brother. Afterwards, I covered it up and helped him hide out. So that ninja... I mean, Gray Fox... He's come here to kill me? I don't think so. I think he just came here to fight you. I wasn't sure before, but now I think I understand. A final battle with you. That's all he lives for. I'm sure of it. Fox. No. Naomi, tell me something. About Fox Dye? Fox dye is a type of retrovirus that targets and kills only specific people. First, it infects the macrophages in the victim's body. Fox dye contains smart enzymes created through protein engineering. They're programmed to respond to specific genetic patterns in the cells. Those enzymes recognize the target's DNA? Right. They respond by becoming active and using the macrophages they begin creating TNF Epsilon. Huh? It's a type of cytokine, a peptide which causes cells to die. The TNF epsilon is carried along the bloodstream to the heart, where they attach to the TNF receptors in the heart cells. And then, they cause a heart attack? The heart cells suffer a shock and undergo an extreme apoptosis. Then, the victim dies. Apoptosis? You mean the heart cells commit suicide? Naomi. What? must have programmed that thing to kill me too, right? Do I still have time? Naomi, I don't blame you for wanting me dead, but I can't go yet. I still have a job to do. Listen, Snake. I'm not the one who made the decision to use Fox Dye. Huh? You weren't? You were injected with fox dye as a part of this operation. I just wanted to let you know that. No, that's not the whole truth. Huh? The real thing I wanted to tell you was... Snake, I... I... Hey, what are you doing? <gasps> I can't allow Naomi to make any more unauthorized transmissions. What? Naomi's been removed from this operation. What happened to Naomi? What did she mean when she said that Fox Dye was a part of this operation? Colonel, let me talk to her. I won't. She's under arrest. Colonel, you double-crossed me. Snake, there's no time for that. Right now, your job is to stop Metal Gear. Okay, Snake? I don't want to have Snake do a punch out of frustration. Okay, um, let's call Master. That place is right in. That 
place is never mind. Nastasha, I'm going to ask you one more time. Do you know anything about Fox Die and the real nature of this operation? Sorry, I have not been told anything about that. That's funny. The Colonel said almost exactly the same thing. Sorry, I didn't mean to sound sarcastic. I believe you. Can't blame him. He's having serious. He's gotta be having serious trust issues by now. I can't really blame Dr. Naomi. I feel sorry for her. Ever since I was a little kid, I always hated my first name. How, isn't it? Yeah, but I'm not a computer, I'm a human. My grandfather taking part in the Manhattan Project. My father being born on the day of the Hiroshima bomb. I hated every part of that. My name, my father, my grandfather. It felt like all those things were a ball and chain around my legs, dragging me down. But now that I think about it, I realize that I was blessed. At least I know who I am, where I came from. But Dr. Naomi didn't even know who her parents were, what her real name was. She must have been a very lonely little girl. Otacon. I bet. Sorry, Snake. I guess right now you should focus on re-inputting those PAL codes. Okay. Let's call Maylene. Actually, let's call Campbell. We'll find him some more. Colonel, what's new with Naomi? She's being interrogated, Snake. Leave her to me. You just worry about stopping Metal Gear. Please, Snake. I consider you my friend. Please believe that. Snake, we're just about out of time. Get to the control room. Alright, now we call Maylene and say. Snake, Naomi's under arrest. What the hell is happening over there? What's the Colonel thinking? Campbell is... I'm sorry, I can't say anymore. But please believe me, I'm here to help you. Until the end. I believe you. Please, Nick, don't give up. Alright. So, let's run through this. Is there a ration? Um, yep, ration. So, I should be maxed out on rations. Alright, get by these guys. Now we gotta go through Gun Turret Central. One last time. Actually. Alright, first off, um, pal check. Still warm? Still warm. Alright. One through. Third pal key. Let's get inserted. But yeah, thank you all for um hopping in and um tuning in for my Metal Gear playthrough. It's been a fun ride. And I don't think we're even halfway and I don't I don't even think we're I I don't think we even we're even halfway through with the series playthrough. My team on this time. Who forget the past are doomed to repeat it. That is why the world must never forget Hiroshima and Nagasaki. So Naomi used 
Fox die to take her revenge on you. Yeah, but she said she wasn't the one who made the decision to use it. According to her, it was just one part of this operation. Hmm. If this goes all the way up to Campbell, it might not be so easy to get that vaccine. Oh well, forget about it. Hurry up and get to the control room. Input that last key. All right. Let's um save one last time. Snake, Four. how are you holding up? Um, I've been better. We've been better. Thanks for asking. Please, Snake, don't give up. All right. One last call key to input. Here we go. Metal Gear should be deactivated now. Oh, so we thought. No. Why? I deactivated it. Oh, oh, that's right. Um, that's right. Um, I, I, I forgot to, I forgot to say this. Um. So. This was the point of no return. Like, after you input, after you inserted the last car key, um, that's it. That's the point of no return. So, if there was any place on Shadow Moses, um, you wanted to go to, or any, or if you wanted to visit, or any place you wanted to go to, to like stock up on ammo and such, um, this was your last chance. Thank you, Snake. Now the detonation code is completed. Nothing can Master? stop Metal Gear now. Master, what's going on? You found the key, and even activated the warhead for us, too. I really must express my gratitude. Sorry to have involved you in that silly shape memory alloy business. What are you talking about? We weren't able to learn the DARPA chief's code. Even with Mantis' psychic powers, he couldn't read his mind. Then Ocelot accidentally killed him during the interrogation. <laughs> In other words, we <coughs> were able to launch the nuclear device and we were all getting... Yo, the Fortnite guy. Without the Yo, the nuggy guy. How's it going? ...would never be met. What do you mean? Without the detonation codes, we had to find... What's up, nuggy? How's it going? Way. Good, good. Decided, Gotta hear that. You might prove useful, Snake. What? First, I thought we might get the information from you, Snake. I'm doing, so I'm doing good. Just dealing, still dealing with some sinus, um, sinus congestion. Unfortunately, Octopus but I'm good. didn't survive the, the encounter, thanks to Fox Die. You mean you had this plan from the beginning, just to get me to input the detonation code? Huh? You didn't think you made it this far by yourself, did you? Who the hell are you? In any case, the launch preparations are complete. Once the world glimpses the power of this weapon, the White House will have no choice but to surrender the Fox Dye vaccine to me. Their ace in the hole is useless now. Ace in the hole? What the? The Pentagon's plan to use you was already successful in the torture room. <laughs> Snake, you're the only one who doesn't know. Ah, oh, poor fool. Who are you anyway? I'll tell you everything you want to know. If you come where I am, that is. Where are you? Very close by. Snake, that's not Master Miller. Campbell, you're too late. Master Miller's body was just discovered at his home. He's been dead for at least three days. I didn't know because my codec link with Master was cut off. But Mei Ling said his transmission signal was coming from inside the base. So who is it? Snake, you've been talking to me, dear brother. Liquid! Liquid? How the... 
I am shocked. You may die. I am shocked. And now we are sealed in. Um, and we are being gassed. So yeah, let's uh, equip the gas mask. Um. Alright, I'm stopped up. Okay. Uh, let's call Otacon. Um. Otacon. Um. Help. Snake, that's bulletproof glass. Beautiful boss you memes. Can't break it with an ordinary weapon. Can't you open the security lock here? I'll try. Just hold on for a minute. Well, I um. Well, I'll, I I I would provide some gas, uh, some boss memes. Um, but not at the sake of my O2 gauge. I hacked into security. Snake, I'm opening the door. All right. Here you go, Nuggy. You are the boss memes. Okay, I'm at full health. I'm stocked up on rations. Yeah. Hang on, guys. Hi everybody, um, okay, yeah, that was mom just now, <laughs> alright, boss memes, and liquid is right there, shirtless, We got a shirtless liquid snake here. Hyping himself up. Bow chicken bow wow. Alright. I know this probably I, I know this I know this probably won't change the cinematic, but Like my sunglasses? Damn. You'd point a weapon at your own brother? Why did you disguise yourself as master? So I could manipulate you more easily. And you performed quite well, I must say. Although the boys at the Pentagon are probably saying the same thing. What the hell are you talking about? Following orders blindly with no questions asked, you've lost your warrior's pride and become nothing more than a palm snake. What? Stopping the nuclear launch, rescuing the hostages, it was all just a diversion. A diversion? The Pentagon only needed for you to come into contact with us. That's what killed the arms tech president and decoy octopus. You don't mean... That's right. You were sent here to kill us so they could retrieve Metal Gear undamaged, along with the bodies of the genome soldiers. From the beginning, the Pentagon was just using you as a vector to spread fox dye. Fox die? It can't be. Are you telling me Naomi was working with the Pentagon? They thought she was, but it seems that Dr. Naomi Hunter couldn't be controlled so easily. What? We've got a spy working in the Pentagon. What? He reported that Dr. Hunter altered Fox Die's program just before the operation, but no one knows how or why. I wonder. Maybe they arrested her so they could find out the answer to that. No doubt. But I had no idea she was motivated by such petty revenge. We still don't know what changes she made to Fox Dye's program. 
Oh well, it doesn't matter. I've already added the Fox Dye vaccine to my list of White House demands. There's a vaccine? There must be, but that woman is the only one who really knows. Anyway, it might prove to be unnecessary. Why is that? You were successful in coming into contact with all of us, so we must have all been exposed to the virus. It's true that the Armstead President and Decoy Octopus were killed by Fox Dye, but Ocelot, myself, and you, the carrier, were apparently unaffected. A bug in the virus's programming? Hmm. Could be. In any case, if it doesn't kill you, then I'm not worried either. After all, our genetic code is identical. So it's true. You and I are... Yes, twins. But we're not ordinary twins. We're twins linked by cursed genes. Les enfants terribles. <laughs> You're fine. You got all the old man's dominant genes. I got the flawed recessive gene. Everything was done so that you would be the greatest of his children. The only reason I exist is so they could create you. Jelly, aren't you? Favorite, huh? That's right. I'm just the leftovers of what they used to make you. Can you understand what it's like to know that you're garbage since the day you were born? Damn. But I'm the one father chose. So that's why you're so obsessed with Big Boss. Some warped kind of love. Love? It's hate! He always told me I was inferior, and now I'll have my revenge! <laughs> you should understand me, brother. You killed our father with your own hands! You stole my chance for revenge! Now I'll finish the work that father began. I will surpass him! I will destroy him! You're just like Naomi. Well, I'm not like you! Unlike you, I'm proud of the destiny that is encoded into my very genes. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh, crap. Snake, your blood will be the first to be spilled by this glorious new weapon. Consider it an honor, a gift from your brother. Now I'll show you. The power of the weapon that will lead us in the 21st century. It's moving. Holy crap, hard. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. 